morning we are leaving Sipkes and making our way to Costa Brava but before that we have to go to uh, Barcelona to pick up our rental car so we are pretty much packed up and tidied up a room a little bit so let me give you a quick room tour before we head out so we are staying in a hotel i mean it's nothing fancy but it's actually a very huge room like i've never seen a room this big um so the first thing here is we have a bathroom i mean just look at the size it's huge we have a bathtub um two sinks his and her um bidet which you will find in every european bathroom a toilet seat i mean pretty basics um we have two wardrobes here, then it's a huge room, comfy bed, a small side TV, um, table, desk. The best part about this hotel is it's right in front of the beach and the views are pretty amazing. I mean, look at this. This was the shortest trip that we have ever done to a country, uh, but it was amazing. So now, let's go to Barcelona. Look at the fancy part. Let me just show you the fancy part. Look oh. at the button over here. Wow. I guess you're versus right. Where's your car keys? Car keys in my pocket. Oh, you gotta hold it. Okay. Oof, look at that. Wow, this is real fancy. The guy was super nice. I mean, he provided with such a great service. His name is Andrew, by the way, if you guys ever come in Barcelona and, and want a rental from Enterprise. He really upgraded us like a, with a very nice car. We just got like a small compact one. And I mean, this is super fancy. I don't even know the model name though. I don't know, yeah. Well, it's next to the Jaguar. Okay. The next one is Jaguar. Yeah, in the so high I mean, end. In the high, in the end, high so, end. Yeah, Plum. like look at this, right? Sit. All right, let's All right, go. perfect. driving towards Costa Brava and we saw that everybody had stopped on this side of the road and we were like why so we pulled over the car and we saw this amazing view I mean this is totally worth stopping look at this this is incredible and we actually pulled over one of our photographs <laughs> we have seen this spot before so we have a picture from five years ago I'll put it down below but this view is amazing we also have a beach there. So we just checked in in our hotel. Uh, we are actually not staying in uh, Costa Brava. We are staying in Tosa del Mar. And it's a decent sized room. Shabnam is taking her siesta over here super tired we only had like a three hour sleep last night and so the room this is a bed big size bed we have tv we have a table to put our stuff do have a closet and a mini fridge and the bathroom is it's decent size too All right, we're gonna take a rest of like a couple of minutes and then head out to the beach. So I finally made sure Shabnam is up because she was kind of snoring. <laughs> I was like, Shabnam, still let's go to the beach. It's just we woke up super early this morning. Yeah. And, uh, We're still super least, tired. Yeah, and by the time the game finished around like 12, by the yeah. time we reached home, it was like. I guess we gotta go that way. 
And it's 3 p.m. in the afternoon and all the stores are closed. Well, not all of them, but like majority of the majority of the stores are closed. Because it's the <laughs> Alright, let's keep walking towards the beach or maybe find a gelato. Ice cream. Yeah, we found a cocoa. So we have come to the beach finally. It's so beautiful here. We both are just soaking in the sun. And Shavnam has already passed out. I'm gonna probably go take a dip in the water and then enjoy the sun. There are so many people here, so many boats, such colorful vibe. And look at that. Where's Shavnam? He's passed out again. Shabnam? No one's. The water is super cold, but it feels so good to be here. Ooh. Alright guys, so right now we are roaming around the streets of Tosa de Mar. It is such a cute little town. Um, initially the plan was we were going to go to another nearby village. Uh, but because the weather is not looking promising at the moment, so we decided to quit that plan. And now we're going to roam the streets, um, shop a little bit because we see a lot many cute boutique stores. And then there's a castle nearby next to the village. So we're going to do a sunset hike there and then see the town views um, and that's about it. Alright, so now we are heading to the castle. We have our coffee and the weather seems nice. And look at the view on the side. I think this is the restaurant that the hotel lady was telling us about. Huh? That this is a really good Italian restaurant. Okay. All right. Dinner also sorted. <laughs> One thing that me and Sid were talking about the other day is that we honestly like the small towns more compared to big cities. I mean, maybe because there's a still a lot of culture intact. It's not a lot crowded and there's like a lot more to see. So let's say this place is not very far from Barcelona. It's like just an hour drive out, but this is the completely different scenario and it's awesome. from this castle are absolutely amazing. I mean, <sighs> this is just magical. This is pure magic. And honestly, we thought that, you know, usually like you hike up to a viewpoint and it's just the viewpoint, but that's not the case here. Actually in the castle, like the walls are of a castle and inside it's like a medieval town with like tapas bars, restaurants, cafes, and like all cute shopping boutiques so it's pretty cool space and I mean the view is always a plus point so it's spectacular it's it's amazing
Honestly, hola, uh, hola, hola, hola. Salgan ya tu ba. The higher we keep going, the views just gets better and better every time. It's it's amazing. I can spend hours and hours looking at the view. Quick note, I need to pee. <laughs>